Hi, this is Ellie Tom Elamin, Qigong and Meditation Master, author, and also breatharian. And I teach breatharianism all around the world to many people. Now today I'm gonna to talk about the breatharian drug and therapeutic lifestyle. Now listen how I said that. The drug and therapeutic lifestyle, not drug-free lifestyle, a drug lifestyle. First of all, you have to understand what a drug is. A drug, the definition, is a thing. It's anything. It's anything that has the power to change the mind and the body. Keep that in mind now. Usually when you think of a drug, you think of something hardcore that's illegal, or you think of something from the doctor. But actually a drug could be anything, that's what the definition says. It could be a beautiful picture and all of a sudden the picture makes you feel a lot better. It could be a cup of tea. It could be a cup of orange juice. Now keep in mind, TNH at times was medicine uh, in many cultures, especially the Chinese. Uh, and even today you could get tea to soothe you, tea to help with different aches and pains, dealing with the medicinals. Uh, it could be music. So there's many different types of drugs that soothe both the body and the mind to heal it for the better. So therefore, when you're on the breast theory and lifestyle, when you understand this, you choose your drugs wisely. Because we're always, our bodies is always by its nature in a healing type mode. It's always healing itself. It's always regenerating itself. It's always renewing itself. Now, since you know this new definition that a drug is anything, you start putting yourself in situations and start dealing with things to bring more healing to your health and your well-being. Because the breatharian path is a healing path. The breatharian path is a path of longevity, and the breatharian path is the path for those, get ready now, for immortality, physical immortality. You understand? So it's more than just eating or not eating. This is a path, a very serious path. It's a very high honor to be in this golden age that we live in, to get this information now, to know that you can eat very little or don't need to eat nothing at all. It's all about energy. So when you deal with these drugs, these things that have the power to alter the brain and alter the mind, just by you being in this presence, just by you being in this experience, and you're going for the things that make you really feel good, to bring health and well-being to your character, this is the breatharian path. Now let's go into therapy. Therapy is one of the oldest healing melodies within the planet. Therapy is basically a health uh, remedy that helps to cure or prevent uh, an illness, sickness, or disease. Keep in mind now, and therapy is also called the, the talking therapy. Do you know that some people can talk you, talk you into being well? You know, that's why it's good to have good social circles with people who talk healthy. This also is a part of the breath theory in the, uh, process. Being around healthy people, being around therapeutic situations. Again, there's music therapy. There's ocean therapy, there's massage therapy, there's Reiki therapy, there's many different types of therapies. So again, you are living a lifestyle in your social circles, in everyday life, putting yourself into a therapeutic mode of life. You understand? Because again, the more you can get yourself dealing with uh, these proper energies in life, the longer you live, the better your health will be and the happier you will be. Because a healthy body is a happy body. A healthy life is a happy life. It don't have nothing to do with materialism and money. I'm here to tell you this now. I'm around a lot of people who have these things and still they have, uh, what? Not peace of mind. Because they don't understand the true drugs of life. The true therapies of life. Now, I used to always tell people, your life should be a retreat. In your home spot, if space, you should make it into a retreat or make it as comfortable as possible. Comfortable for your health and well-being. I make sure to put beautiful 
uh, uh, pictures on the wall. I make sure, uh, especially when I was living in an urban situation, to light candles on the weekend. Do the best you can to bring these therapies to your well-being, to your body. This is what brings more light in the body. You understand? And as you're doing this and as you're on this path, keep in mind that as you're dealing with light, which is our foundation, which is also health, the people you're around. See, I do healings, a lot of healings to many different people, and they ask me, uh, Ellie Tom, how do you heal them? And I say, I don't heal the people. The people heal themselves. But what I do is I live a therapeutic drug lifestyle. I live a high level energetic vibration lifestyle to where my body is healed and balanced out. So when I'm in a person's presence, as soon as I put, get close to a person, I don't even lay my hands on them. Their body reacts to mine because we're already in each other's electromagnetic field and you become a healing vessel for other people. You understand? So if you want to change the world, change yourself. Work on your own energy. And the more in your, in your body and your mind by its nature, always deal with a process called homeostasis. It's always doing an energy balancing act to balance itself out. So make meditation a foundation of your lifestyle. Balance your energies out every day, all through the day, and you will become a healing vessel for the world for other people. As soon as they feel your presence, they'll feel at ease. You are it. Because because you understand you're living this therapeutic drug lifestyle that is better into your well-being. And just by you changing yourself, you are so powerful that you are changing the consensus reality, the whole energy matrix of the planet. This is why we're in the golden age. I know, and this isn't talking arrogant, I know by me being grounded, I'm going to change the world, and so are you. All right, talk to you later, talk to you soon, and keep in mind, keep going on. This is the best lifestyle you can live. We're in a golden age, and don't you forget this. All right, bye-bye, and have a nice day.